Hey guys, uh, we're on our way. We have a uh, dual tandem trailer behind a dually that's hauling trusses. He's dropped the trailer off the side of the road. It says it's a single axle little country road that we can't get a big wrecker into. So we're gonna take the road back. I don't know if we'll have enough truck to do what we need to do or not. He's not exactly sure where he's at. So hopefully we find him. But anyway, we'll uh, see you here in a few minutes. guys we're gonna try to run the cable from the rollback back to this tree to the trailer and back to the tree Let's get this set up and then we'll go from there. So I only see this block and then that one. You can get it out. We'll look at it in halves, you know. Can we get it out and let you look at it or what? Yeah, get it out. about the same I don't know if it'll get that strap caught in that wheel but if it does we'll just have to cut it out if, if we can get lucky enough to get it out so yeah Oh, we got all kinds of that kind of stuff in, the, in our big wreckers, you know, yeah. or semi stuff. This guy go back and, and then back. And back up, right? If we got another. Don't pull, let him, hold on sir, don't pull. He's gonna watch the cable, so don't pull it all off. Easy. Hold on a second. How much we got left? Hold on. Easy, easy, easy. Hold on. I'm gonna have to get a chain. Easy, let me just pull it. Go slow. Oh. Get to the it's close. When it stretches out, <clears throat> got it.
future strap. It's all right, it got out. <laughs> yeah. That's what scared That shit goes everywhere. <laughs> all right, guys, y'all saw that strap break. That's a good old Harbor Freight strap, but we had to use what we had here, so. Let me try to get you a little bit more. Huh? We'll put a chain in there, maybe. I think it'll pull Ford out of there. All right, go forward. All right, guys, he's out of there. Yeah, it on right there. Yeah. Then then get get caught, yeah. Huh? Then get caught. I guess this is where it's jacked. Alright, we're gonna get the uh all the rigging picked up, put away, and get paid and go to the next one. Huh? Oh. It was over it was over an edge though, so there's no way to protect the edge the way it was, so because luckily it went that way away from all of us. Alright guys, I'm gonna turn this camera off. I'll leave you on the helmet cam on the pick up. That's that one. We'll see if my dad has uh, any commentary on it. That's all. all right, guys. Let's find out from the man what his thoughts are on the job. <laughs> What's you your thoughts? Know my thoughts? Yeah. What's your thoughts? I don't know. My son gets aggravated, and he won't. He don't think that you have to figure out shit sometimes. Sometimes you got everybody yourself. There ain't yeah. no sense us going back if we don't try it. Well, it's too... I know it was aggravating. It, we should have brought another truck. Well, but we didn't get the right information. Well, my thoughts are it's too hard on equipment. We I end up equipment tearing everything. equipment up. Uh, hey, they make it every day. <laughs> get, you know, for a, a job that doesn't pay a whole lot, we might tear up a whole lot. So that was... We did tear up nothing. No, but Man, we were we were over overworking it, so... No, we put work on the tree. Hey, thank God for home trees. <laughs> yeah, definitely a home tree. If you, if you worked old school like I did back in the day, you understand this. You, you, you're spoilt with this hydraulic stuff. Yeah. Big old heavy quick. Well, we're used to hooking a big truck to it and just hitting the lever and, <laughs> yeah. and everything scoots. And that would have been nice. No problem. Well, no more, uh, triple nine with it. Uh, but it would have been a whole lot harder to back in where we just backed uh, in. Oh, we're probably... Oh, man, it's pretty good. Like we're, triple nine back to that big hill? we're probably two miles back you think at least two miles back i didn't have you guys on camera there's a heck of a hill on the other side yeah, here pretty good grades, too. yeah so he said he's got pacemaker and uh, that old man and, and my dad walked back here while i was turning the truck around because first we pulled in here almost all the way and then we backed up backed all the way out and backed all the way in so uh, but after we got back here, we probably should have been pulled in, but we'd had to back back out and back down the big hill, so. Hey, it was a lot of fun. Uh, yeah, it's, it, luckily it all worked out. It might not There's something. Been. What's that? What's that right there? That's one of them that's going to get about my little track. That's one of them Yeah. He's safe been down here all day working on it. Yeah. Yeah, he, uh, he got this tree up pretty good. All the way up down through here. The truck is banged up pretty good, too. 
I guess they're building a house somewhere at the end of this road. Yeah, they're building a big old house out back here. Yeah, this tree here dug in pretty good, but we didn't do that. You saw we run saw straps around our home's tree that we use, so. He's been in the deep. Yeah, he's done. He's tried everything. So, and honestly, he couldn't even tell us where he was. Uh, yeah, I don't even think we're in our county, honestly. Yeah, if we are, we're right on the edge, so. But anyway, that's enough for this job. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe. Uh, I don't know how this will edit out, but uh, <laughs> we'll see. Yeah. So, yeah, see you next time. Wow. The saga continues, guys. Um, he got back to the end of the road as far as he could. There's a gate across the road, and he can't go any further, and he can't turn around, and he can't drop the trusses. So, he's got to back all the way out of here to the main road. Over two miles for sure. So, and we try to do it before it gets dark. So, we'll see what hey guys, happens. Uh, real quick. I'm sitting here editing the video on um, the truss trailer, we'll call it, that was hung up in the uh, in the woods there. And uh, I just noticed that I didn't finish the video out after the guy backed out. So uh, the gentleman was able to back all the way out. There's almost three miles altogether. We, we did calculate it, almost three miles around some sharp bends and uh, pretty steep gravel hills up and down. So anyway, he got out. Uh, like I said, I just realized I didn't close the video out. So just to let you know what happened. He got out and, uh, and we'll keep uh, we'll keep on editing. See you soon, guys. Thank you.